Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. What a wonderful So today's video is another weekly vlog. It's currently Thursday night. I just finished with my workout. I did a little Sydney Cummings workout on YouTube. It was cardio, so I sweat a lot. And I was about to go on the um, bike that we have at our gym downstairs, but let me show you the state of outside because it is like hurricane force winds and rain. It is insane out there. Well, now it's not, but I swear it was just raining really hard. But anyways, <laughs> I wanted to show you, I got my Cincy Club in, and then I also got a few things in from Old Navy, so let me turn the camera around. Okay, so my Cincy Quarterly Club, I only have a few things in here just because I like these and I go through them pretty quickly, so I've got Vanilla Bean Buttercream, absolute must, Crumb Top, which I fell in love with um, last year, so I had to keep that, and same with Graham Cracker Crunch. Um, Coconut Pumpkin Pie, I found in a Bring Back My Bar earlier this year, I think. And it was, it's so good, I just had to keep that. And then hazelnut latte. So that's my little um, Scentsy Quarterly Club. And then I also have a 20 watt bulb. And then from Old Navy, I got this um, really cute activewear dress, but I tried it on. I got a size medium and I probably should have got a small. Um, Old Navy sizing is a little bit um, bigger than like Lululemon or something. So I was thinking like that and yeah, it's too big for me. These sides right here kind of gape open and this bra that's in, attached inside shows. So it's just really odd, but it is super cute. It just doesn't fit me right. And then I got this little shirt for 4th of July. So that's my little haul for now. The Old Navy stuff that I did buy, I did a pretty big purchase, is coming in like one by one. I think I got like five or six items. So there's definitely more to come for that order. Um, but pretty sad that I have to exchange that exercise dress because it looks really cute and I could see myself wearing it like all summer long. Um, and then I, of course, got a little 4th of July tank top. It's a little cheaper quality than I expected because online it looked really cute and looked like it was knit, but it's definitely not knitwear. It's just like a plain tank top. Um, so yeah, that's, that's it for now. Um, I've been doing some vacation shopping online. Um, I think I want to buy a red bikini before we go on vacation. I'm going to be um, at the beach for the week of 4th of July. So just stocking up on some beach essentials. But yeah, that's it for the updates for now. I'm going to go shower because I'm, like I said, all sweaty and gross. And then Ryan and I are probably going to cuddle on the couch because it is a rainy day. It's dreary and maybe have like a glass of wine or something and dinner. So I will talk to you guys later. guys it is currently Sunday it's about two o'clock and um, I got up pretty early this morning mostly because of Kai so we had a very sick weekend with Kai he had some stomach problems and I'll leave it at that we had to clean it up a lot so basically since Thursday he's been having problems we brought him to the vet on Friday got him some medication but Thursday and Friday were just terrible we were up with him throughout the night um, cleaning up after him and taking him out as much as we possibly could like every hour or every two hours when I got a little better but yeah this weekend was a blur because we were just basically trying to take care of him but yesterday he was a lot better we were able to leave for a few hours to go on our anniversary dinner so last night Ryan and I celebrated our two-year anniversary so that's exciting. We went to a very nice restaurant that we go to for like all of our special occasions called Eddie V's for dinner. It's like a steakhouse slash seafood place. Um, and it was amazing. It never disappoints. The food there is so good. And you guys saw um, yesterday morning, he actually went and got us some donuts from um, Voodoo and made us a wonderful spread for breakfast. So it was a really nice day yesterday. And then today we've just kind of been cleaning up. Um, I moved everything out of my bathroom 
uh, and everything off of the counters so that Kai could have a space that if basically this is where we like quarantined him was my bathroom so we just kind of cleaned the whole thing today and I put everything back to where it belongs so that was like most of the day this morning um, I got up with Kai at 8 we went outside and I did a workout and I did a Peloton um, tread which is like the treadmill a Peloton walk for pride and it was really fun. Um, one of the instructors is actually a drag queen so he was all dressed up and it was just so much fun and his drag personality, she's so cool. So I thought that was a lot of fun. Um, so I did that around like noon, showered, washed my hair. My blow drying brush actually broke. So I had this really old one, I think from like TJ Maxx. That was like a knockoff of the Revlon blow dry br brush, but it twirls. It like actually spins, but it like short circuited the last time I used it. So we're gonna have to go with curly hair and I might have to purchase the Shark Flex thing. Let me know what you guys think about that, if you've tried it or if you've seen it. Um, but I'm thinking, uh, I'm definitely not gonna buy the um, Dyson Airwrap because that's so expensive, but the Shark one's only like a couple hundred dollars. So I could justify that. Um, but I might also just go with like a Revlon one that's like 40 bucks. So I'm still debating on that. So I'm probably gonna buy one of those today, um, but I'm just chilling. <laughs> Um, I think we're gonna have like a gaming day. Ryan downloaded like an old Spider-Man game and I've got Disney Dreamlight Valley. So I'm gonna be playing that. I might have some updates for you guys later on, but it's only like two o'clock right now. I definitely need to do my nails today. As you can see, I cut them short and I took all the polish off. So I need to do my fingernails and my toenails. I usually paint my toenails like once a month. Um, and I have not yet for June, so I gotta pick out a color. Let's just pick out a color right now. I'm not gonna paint them right now, but we can pick out a color um, together and do my nails. So I probably will play while I do my nails because that's usually what I end up doing is like either watching a movie or doing something in the background. So, okay, let's pick out a toenail color and then we will come back. Okay, we are under my sink in case you were ever wondering about like how I store this. This is a little two-tier storage from Ross. And I've got all my nail polishes here I've collected th throughout the years. I actually did a declutter of this, um, I don't know, earlier this year um, and ignore my Band-Aid. I cut my finger earlier this morning. But um, these are all my gel polishes and then these are just regular ones. I'm thinking we'll do like a red. Right now I have this bubblegum pink on my nails. I've got this OPI little mini red, this Essie red, but it's like a little more dark than I want. I'm thinking like candy apple red or even this, this pink's pretty. I could also do white because I am going to be at the beach uh, for the first weekend of July. So maybe if I don't want to paint my toes again, I'll just leave them white. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to do white just because that won't last very long. I'm not going to do this bubblegum pink again. So it's either hot pink. OPI, that's very daring. This red, or this red from Essie, twin sweater set. I think I'm gonna save this red for 4th of July. And I think we're gonna do this hot pink. Oh, I just remembered though, I do also have this beautiful blue color. I love wearing blue toenail polish in the summer. And I have this turquoise. My dog sled is a hybrid, is this one. This blue is rich girls and po' boys. That's adorable. I think I'm gonna do this blue actually. This is so pretty when you apply it. It's like this wonderful sky blue color. Okay, now that we picked that out, I'm gonna go play games. Um, I assume we're gonna have like a movie night tonight and that's probably when I'm gonna paint my toenails, but that's it for now. I will talk to you guys later. Hello guys. It is currently Monday afternoon. It's like 3.50 and I'm about to hop on the treadmill. I usually spend like the last hour of the workday on my walking treadmill desk area setup. Um, but I wanted to come on and end the vlog off here pretty short. Like I said, we kind of had a wrench thrown in our plans, but uh, Kai is feeling a lot better. He's doing very, very good. He went all through the night last night didn't even need to be quarantined so he's doing really good so don't worry about him we got him settled um but yeah that's it for now I'm just noticing in the 
in the screen that my face is dewy and beautiful. Wow. Okay. I'm loving that. But anyways, it's a sunny day here. I would love to go sit by the pool, but I just did. I just redid my curly hair and it looks really cute. So I don't really want to uh, mess that up. <laughs> but anyways, okay. I'm going to go hop on the treadmill and, um, oh, I will overlay some footage. I did play Disney Dreamlight Valley yesterday and I got a few new characters. So I'm on the hunt for Minnie Mouse. She keeps showing up as like a ghost kind of. She's like in a different plane or something so i have to find her basically the gist of the game is that you're trying to save the town from this like evil that made all the characters go away so you start off with um merlin the wizard mickey mouse goofy and scrooge mcduck so you start off with those guys and you have to like work your way up to get more characters so yeah i'm trying to get Minnie mouse um, and then I got Moana and Maui yesterday and I'm trying to like build their homes and stuff. So it's pretty fun. Like I just like doing games that are like chill and relaxing like that. Like nothing's hard. There's not anything skill based to it. So it's pretty similar to like Animal Crossing if that's your vibe. So it's really cute. So anyways, that's what I did yesterday. Pretty much just chilled the rest of the night. And as you can see, I did not do my nails or my toenails. So I'll have to do that tonight. But Anyways, I'm going to end off the vlog here. Pretty short one. Didn't do much, like I said, but hope you guys enjoyed anyways, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye.